So next to field surface practices, aquacrop can also simulate the effect of mulches. Mulches will reduce soil evaporation. It can be straw, for example, here with the strawberries, or can be a plastic mulch. When specifying mulches, we have to specify the soil cover and the type of mulch. The soil cover can vary between 0 and 100%, and depending on the type of mulch, the reduction in evaporation will be different. It will be about 50% for organic mulches and 100% for plastic mulches. To illustrate the effect of mulches, let's run the simulation of the irrigated tomatoes in Foggia. The tomatoes are cultivated on a loam soil and planted on the 1st of April. Aqua crop generate the irrigation schedule. Let's run without any mulches. I can see that the production is high, 9.9 tons, that the amount of water which was applied by irrigation is 490, but 115.7 millimeters of water was lost by soil evaporation. The water productivity is high as well, 1.56. So without mulches, we have a yield of 9.9 .9 tons. The soil evaporation is 115.7. We applied 490 millimeters of water and our water productivity is 1.56. Let's now see the effect of mulches. Therefore, I return to the main menu, go to field management, and in the tab sheet of mulches, I'm going to consider mulches. I take a complete cover, 100%, and the type of mulches are organic plant material, which gives a reduction of the soil evaporation by 50%. I return to the main menu and run the example again. I have the same yield, 9.9 .9 tons, but the amount of irrigation water is reduced to 455. That is because my evaporation is reduced as well, 76.3 millimeters. Since I have the same yield, but with less evapotranspiration, the ET water productivity is higher. Let me write down those numbers. Thanks to the application of organic mulches, the yield remains the same, but the evaporation reduces to 76.3, and as a consequence, we have to apply less water, 455. Since the yield remains the same, but soil evaporation reduces, then the water productivity will increase to 1.66. Finally, let's now put plastic. So I return to the main menu and I go back to the field. And now the type of mulches is a plastic which reduce soil evaporation completely. Let me reduce the soil cover by to 90%, just to allow some rain to infiltrate as well. I return to the main menu, run my example again. The yield remains always high, close to 10 tons. The amount of water needed in irrigation reduced to 420 the evaporation to 21.3 and the water productivity increased to 1.83. When we apply the plastic mulches, we still have the same yield, but evaporation has now reduced to 21.3 millimeters. As a consequence, we have to apply less water, 420, and the 
ET water productivity will further increase because we have the same yield but with less water lost by evapotranspiration on the field.